Welcome back to my channel, everyone. And today, magluluto tayo ng kakaibang breakfast, which has bacon and eggs then, pero Asian noodle style. Okay, so I got this recipe from a famous Aussie Thai chef who is Marion Grasby. And dun ako nakakakuha ng ideas bago ideas. Although, uh, meron akong ipahing style um, dahil nga may techniques siya na medyo matagal gawin. So, para mapadali ang buhay natin, uh, we will make her recipe as a guide to make this uh, bacon and egg uh, stir fry or Asian style, Korean style noodles. Okay? So, kailangan natin ng okay, udon. You can buy this at the grocery store. Mura na lang to para mga, I don't know, 40, 40 pesos each. <clears throat> okay? So, this serves one person. So, since dalawa kami ng anak ko, dalawang packets. Then, of course, we need bacon. Alright? Favorite ng anak ko ang bacon. So, gamit tayo ulit ng bacon. Although we had breakfast na bacon yesterday, pero yun naman, regular cooked bacon lang. So, ibayin natin siya. We need an onion. <clears throat> we need kimchi. Mainly the juice. Ewan ko kung may juice pa to, pero we'll, we'll see what we can do. Uh, we need uh, scallions or green onions. Okay. Um... She's using one tablespoon of soy sauce, but I'm using one tablespoon of nor seasoning, <coughs> uh, sesame oil, and then honey. Okay? So, bago ang lahat, may gagawin kayong sauce. Okay? O nga pala, bago makalimutan, two eggs. We need two eggs. tag kami ng anak ko. So, gagawin mo na natin yung sauce. Pupuksan ka na final yung aking honey. Okay. So, dito tayo mag-mix. I'm gonna make it sweeter dahil wala lang, trip ko lang. Ibahin ko yung, yung, ano, yung proportion ng wow! Ibahin ko yung proportion ng recipe niya. Okay. So, meron akong Facebook group may nagtanong, <clears throat> uh, paano malalaman kung pure or fake yung honey? Or hindi naman fake, adulterated yung honey. Okay? So, dapat daw nakikristalize or namumuo. Actually, sabi yun ang kapatid ko. And then, I research, o nga, kasi di ba yung honeycomb, Buo naman talaga siya. So, ang pure honey, nakalagay dito, pure honey, bee honey. So, sabi, namumuo dapat. Yung iba siya sabi, hindi daw dapat namumuo. Which is wrong daw. Da, kailangan daw namumuo. Kasi nga, yung totoong honey ko, yung bahay ng bubuyog, buo yun. Okay? And sa init lang ng panahon ngayon, hindi natin ma-determine kung gano'n nga mangyayari. Ayoko tong ilagay sa ref. Pero para daw malaman mo, ilagay mo sa ref. Pag namuo siya, pure honey siya. Ayoko ilagay sa ref kasi nga, ginagamit ko siyang pang luto. Mas workable siya kung tunaw-tunaw. Alright. <clears throat> Then, we would need, so I put in about, sabihin mo na lang, 2 tablespoon to. Uh, yan. And then, we will put in a tablespoon of nor seasoning. We'll mix that. And then, we would need kimchi juice daw. Malamay kayo sa kong ng kimchi. So, we need kimchi juice. Actually, wala siya masyadong kimchi juice. Ah, uh, yun lang. Anyways, 
Ah, okay. So, alam ko na ang gagawin natin. Since wala akong kimchi juice, nakalimutan ko pala. We will use gochujang. Stuck ko sa freezer. Gagamit tayo ng gochujang. Gagyan na nga natin ng gochujang. Pambuksan na nga ito kasi kakaubos ko lang ng isa. Okay. So, let's open. Uy, sayang nga yung dumitig sa foil. Uh -huh. Dating yung aking spoon. Scrape natin yan. Kasi sayang yan, no? So, bojo chang. Paste. Okay. Babi yan. Inisin natin yung gigit. Let's put in a tablespoon of gochujang. <clears throat> uh, a teaspoonful, sorry. Okay, hindi pa ako nagkakape. So, pagpasensyahan nyo na kung sabog-sabog na naman yung utak ko. Okay, signs of aging. Okay. So, anyways. Okay, scrape natin yan. Okay. Kumitin na lang natin. Mas gusto ko talaga ang pang mix itong spoon na ito. Okay. Yes. May natansik ka na ko. <laughs> Alright. So, we will also use, sabi niya, a tablespoon of sesame oil. But, ayoko na masyado matapang. I'll just put in a teaspoon. Okay. So, ito yung ating pinaka-sauce sa noodles natin. Alright? Parang konti, no? Hmm. Parang konti. But, we'll see. Two tables po na nga ng, ano eh, ng honey na baby ko. Pero, para siyang konti lang. Anyways, set aside natin to. Tago na natin itong rojo siya. Uh, prepare natin yung ating scallions or sabi niya na green onion. Okay. Ano lang to? Garnishing lang sa later. Para naman merong fresh component ng ating noodles later on. Okay. okay. So we have our scallions or your green onions. And then, tabi natin ng konti. Tabi natin siya dito. Uh, we'll use one red onion. Ayaw masyado ni Nina ng maraming onion. So, ito, thin strips lang for me. Dun sa original recipe, naka-chop siya. But for me, I just want it thin. And then, So, we'll let this boil. Walang asin or anything like that. Okay? Okay, boil muna natin siya. I'm gonna put in the udon habang pa-boil pa lang siya. So, kung pansin nyo, dikit-dikit to. Which is just fine. Okay? Hindi natin siya dyan. Luto na ito guys, okay? Paghihiwa-hiwayin niyo lang natin. <clears throat> Paghihiwa-hiwayin lang natin siya. And then we're gonna ready ourselves 
with cold water kung saan natin siya ilalagay. So here, medyo kumukulo na siya. Close to boiling, but really not boiling. And then, I'm just separating the noodles. Okay? Kasi nga, very delicate na ito. Duto na kasi siya. So, pinag-ihiwai, walay ko lang siya. Alright. I guess this is done. So, yung residual heat, ayan. So, nag-ihiwai, walay na siya. <coughs> Excuse me. Yun lang naman yung kailangan natin. Pag-ihiwai, walay na siya. Okay? And then, as I mentioned, we're gonna drain this. And we're gonna soak this in cold water or ice water. So, drain ko lang sa bit. Mainit. Okay, so, yan na. Meron ng cold water. Soak na muna natin siya. Para hindi siya magdikit-dikit. Okay? So, as you can see, very firm yung ating wooden. Nice. <clears throat> okay. Now, we're gonna start cooking our bacon and eggs. <laughs> Set aside muna natin po. Okay. So, I'm gonna use gagamit tayo ng used oil. Okay? Ang gagawin muna natin, we're gonna fry uh, this is a combination of canola and bacon fat. <laughs> Alright. So, gagamit tayo ng used oil to fry our egg. Dun sa recipe, it's uh, like, um, what do you call this? Yung eggs na merong coating. I forgot the name. But in this instance, gusto natin medyo mabilis, hindi matrabaho, we're gonna fry our eggs. Just normal way of frying it. Okay? So, hinaan ko yung apoy ko. And then, just fry our egg. Sana hindi mabasag yun. Ayoko na mabasag yung hula. So, one for me. And one for me. See? How nice it is. Hindi na lang ganun ko lang. Ay, di mo lang na siya. Okay. So, gusto ko yung akin crispy on the outside. Just yung bilit-bilit. But, Malasado. Ah! Oh, malasado sa gitna. Okay. Enough na to. I'm not gonna put in uh, salt or anything like that. Just get us right it. Okay? So, one egg down. I'm so sorry. Tumutulo talaga yung pounds ko. Okay. One egg down. So, sabi nila para walang shell, you crack your egg uh, on a flat surface. Good, buo. Very fresh yung eggs na nakuha ko. So, we're done with this. Tapos na yung eggs natin. Inuna ko na kasi I'll be using the same pan. Usually, huli ito, no? But, I'll be using just one pan. Kung ano ko nang gumamit ng napakaraming pan. So, there. Tapos na yung ating isang egg. Uh-huh. Then, sikan pa ako sa mata, diba? Okay, ganun talaga. Pag nagluluto, is ganda din. Okay, so, I'm gonna drain out this fat. And, uh, hindi pa naka-on yung aking gas, lalagay ko na yung aking bacon. Now, we will cook this until medyo crispy. Okay. So, wala akong mantika pag mamantikain natin yung bacon natin. So, yan. Lumabas na yung fat. Okay. So, yun. Ito sa mukha ko. Diba? <laughs> Ang daming fat talaga ng bacon, diba? 
So, guys, pag nagluluto ka ng bacon, huwag niyo matagka siyang lalagyan ng mantika. Kasi maluluto siya sa sarili niyang mantika. Okay. So, this is enough. Baka, uh, ano naman, masulit naman yung bacon natin. Pinatake ko na. So, I'm gonna get this much for our toppings later. Balay natin to. So, wow! Golden bacon. Now, I'm not gonna use lahat ng fat na yan, okay? Okay, we're gonna drain that out. My God, tumutuloy yung paris ko. Sa ito ka lang. Okay. Drain natin. Nakita niyo ba tumutuloy yung paris ko? So, we're just gonna leave about one and a half tablespoon of bacon fat. Diba? Nakakatakot. <laughs> Nakakatakot kumain ng bacon pag nakita ko yung malabas yung mantika. Wow, ang ganda. Ang ganda ng kulay niya. Actually, one tablespoon. You want one tablespoon? You want one tablespoon? You want one tablespoon? You want one tablespoon? So, sorry. Yan na sa ito yung mukha ko. We have here the bacon that's remaining. Yan natin yung, tumitin natin yung turn ito. We're gonna add in, gonna fill up our pan again. We're gonna add in our onions. We're gonna add in our onions. So, isa natin yan. And then, we're gonna add more cream cheese. So, hindi matapos yung mga cream cheese. So, ito ang super food mga korean. So, hindi natin, ano, kalahating bote. This is, um, green cabbage kimchi. We're gonna add a little bit of water. Okay. Hindi, okay, isa muna natin ang ingat. Okay. a little bit of water. Just a little bit. Kasi nga, what? Kulang tayo ng kimchi juice. Ito na yung kimchi guys, ha? So, mabilis lang talaga ito. So, once it is saucy-saucy like that, natural siya ko lang na ano yung sauce niya. Okay. So, may saucy like that. I'm gonna add our udon. There's a little bit of water, but it's fine. Okay. Then, then use, look at the color. So, hindi 
dito kasi red nung original recipe kasi baka hindi masyadong gusto ng ano ko yung spice mo. In fact, there's chili flakes pero hindi ko nalalagyan ng chili flakes. Okay. So, you let the udon noodles absorb the sauce. <laughs> breakfast, di ba? Breakfast na dito ng eggs. Noodles. Ay, naku. Okay. This is good. This is good. I'm gonna turn it off. Okay. And then, now that it's done, this is how we're gonna plate it. Okay. Actually, dyan na yan. Okay? Dyan na siya. Hindi ko na siya gagawin. We're just gonna make sure na presentable yung ating noodles. Let's put the kimchi on the top. Okay? I don't mind the onions. scotch eggs yun sa kanya, but this is my version. Just fried in crispy bacon. A lot of scallops. Okay. So, we can see this. Bacon and eggs na Korean style. Korean, Japanese. Kasi udo is Japanese. Korean yung gojuchang kimchi. Pansit style. Itlog na pinrito, di ba? Usually tayo mga Filipinos. Pansit canton, tsaka itlog mo ito. Try nyo. Baka pwede din ito sa pansit canton. Huwag nyo lang ilagay yung ano yung pancit canton mix, yung sauce ang gawin niya, nakatulad ng ginawa. Mmm, sarap! Nanunakam na ako. Hindi yung nagisipisip si Junaki. So, let's try this without her. Just gonna try the noodles. Kuha ko ng stong. Tabunan ng ikaw pa. 
It's a shame. Expectation ko, maalat-alat, matamis na ang hangang. But it smells good. Pasensya na, bagong gising. Tapos ang init pa. Tingnan nyo naman yung buko. Yan na naman talaga pag nanay, di ba? Lalo na sa umaga. Hindi na naman kapalitas. Ang secret lang dito, huwag nyo i-overcook yung udon. Ay, yung noodles, huwag nyo i-overcook. Pag iwahiwalay na lang siya, and then pag nag-iwahiwalay na, baba nyo na kaagad sa malamig na tulad para chewy-chewy pa siya, tsaka hindi durog-durog. Hmm. Ang breakfast ako mag-isa, di ba? 
Dahil na po yun kami kagabi. Nagiging pa kayo mo. Partially, nag-start na ako maging paket. And then, siya naman nanonood ng Netflix. Bakasyon naman, so... Pagbigyan natin yung bakasyon. Hmm, sarap. Bacon nitong huling subo ko ah. Hmm. So this is enough to give me energy for the day. The body today. Venus day. Asok na naman bukas. Hmm. Masarap yung kimchi na nabili ko. Pakit ko yung brand. So, kimchi. Green cabbage. Sarap. Hmm. Uy! Sarap. Uy, thanks again for watching another cookbang with me. Parang tabingin na yung camera ko. Anyways, sa susunod ulit na kukbang, mahihain si daughter. Naririnig ko gising na sa loob ng kwarto, pero hindi pa naman na Dahil alam niya na kwipin mo. <laughs> so anyway, thanks again for watching. Pagpasensya niya na. Bye!